Hello and welcome again to Clean Nuts. Today we're changing the oil seal in the tail of a Type 9 Ford gearbox. And this one's in situ in the car. So we're going to pry that oil seal out and we're going to insert a new one. But let's check we've got the right one first. Here's the oil seal. Notice it's got a spring. That is on the inside, so we're going that way round. So this will be the tail of the, gear, the gearbox. It's quite a tight fit. Now we're going to press it home with a socket. That is a 34mm socket. Which is slightly too small. That is a 32mm but very heavy duty socket. Slightly too big. See what else we've got? That socket's slightly too big. That socket's slightly too small. That socket's massive. I think we'll get it in. Let's try. Now, right from the start, it seemed to be picking a fire at me. Start to break through the seal here. It seemed to be in very, very tight, and I was conscious not to damage the aluminium casing of the gearbox. So I'll try on that side. Went back to this side. Swap to a bigger, heavier hammer. You feel like you're pushing it in. And suddenly, you can get a bit of purchase on it. Out it came. Finally. Then what I was doing here was checking the, the surface that I've left behind. Now I want to check the spring is still in the right place on that lip on the seal. If we look at the old one which we mounted that way in. It's looking from inside the gearbox and there's a spring there. See it? there. So I'm going to put this probe in and see if I can feel it. I was having a good look with that torch as well. What I wanted to avoid was hooking the spring out, assuming it is in the groove and it's, it's fitted correctly. The last thing I want to do is undo the good work that I've done putting the spring back in with the seal in situ would be very difficult so it's very delicately seeing if I could just feel the spring on the tip of that uh, little awl that I had there. I thought I could so and I couldn't see any sign of the spring inside the gearbox with the torch so I'm assuming that it went in okay. Couple of spots are three in one. I didn't want to damage the oil seal as I inserted the end of the prop shaft. So just leave it up a bit. Oh, went in nicely. Well, there you go. That's how you change the tail stock oil seal on Ford Type 9 gearbox. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed Clean Nuts and I'll see you next time.